Hey everybody, it's Rob Nazarian with Talk Android, and we're here looking at the brand new Galaxy S5 in New York. Uh, it was just introduced at uh, Mobile World Congress, and uh, has a 5.1 inch display, has a new, little bit of a new design, it looks very similar to past Galaxy devices with that new perforated uh, look on the back. And um, as a full HD display, uh, we didn't get two versions of the Galaxy S5 like we thought we would. Uh, the display is uh, an active display, so it changes with based on colors, and it has uh, super dimming. The battery is 2800 milliamps, uh, and it also has a ultra power saving mode uh, that will, at 10% left, uh, will basically make it a black and white picture and turn off much of the things except for text messages and calls, which can make it go another 24 hours in, in uh, standby mode. Um, the, the UI looks very much the same as in the past. They're calling it a simpler look. Um, in the settings, um, whoops, in the settings there, I didn't touch the settings properly, has a different look now to it. That's where the round icons come from that everybody was uh, talking about. Still have the home button, and right now we're not going to be able to test it, but the home button does have a fingerprint scanner uh, built into it. You just slide it. Uh, they didn't talk about if, there's gonna, if it's going to accept uh, different fingers to open up different apps, but that may be the case as well. But you can see the overall look is uh, pretty much the same. You'll see a, there's a gear manager already installed and a gear fit manager, uh, which we'll be talking about that as well. But uh, most of it does look pretty much the same. Um, you know, with, with this is going to be surrounded a lot by fitness. And um, you'll also get with the fingerprint scanner, uh, you'll be able to do a kids mode and um, you'll be able to make credit card payments with it as well. The SL card of the, of the um, phone will also have a coach that will help you with uh, exercise, food, stress, and all that. Uh, I don't know if that's pretty installed on here. Uh, there's the kids mode. And um, the smart remote is also on here as well. And that's pretty much it. Um, looks like a pretty, pretty much, uh, you know, very much similar as uh, the last couple of Galaxy phones. It's not a major design change. Uh, they're just trying to make things simpler, bigger battery, a little bit bigger display. But overall, uh, that's what is going to be available in April worldwide.